good morning students today we move with the formation of soil in class 7th actually the formation of soil it is a very slow process it take a thousands of year to form a thin layer of a soil and it is already mentioned that the weathering process breaks the rocks into small particles and these particles carried away by winds wind water and deposited at a new place such type of soil is called a transported soil but when the soil is formed by weathering of rocks and remains present on the same site is called the residual soil one number one the formation of soil that is formed with the weathering process and it is a long term process or it take a thousands of layer to form a layer of a soil second the transported soil when these weathering particles carried away by the wind and water and deposited into new place that is called the transported soil and the second one when the soil is formed by the weathering of parent rock and remains present on a same site that is called the residual soil the soil forming process continues over a long span of time it starts developing in layers one over the other and these layer called the horizons the process soil forming process continues over a long span of time and it start developing layer one over other that is called the horizons from bottom to top the lowest horizon of the horizon of weathered rock and it is followed by the subsoil and top soil the topmost horizon is reached in humus i just show you a picture 